guys, welcome back. It's Thursday the 26th of January and I am on Central Drive and about to turn down Rigby Road. So I'm here to give you a couple of updates. As you can see, the fence has been taken down on our field. Well, it's not been taken down, the wooden parts of the fence have been taken down but there's still a railing part there so we can see through there so that's cool and there's actually news that there's going to be football pitches filled and at least part of that field planning permission has gone through and news has gone through and also while we're going through here I'm going to give you an update on the old field site which from what I've heard it's going to be a definitely going to be a Taco Bell and as we can see here there are steel works going up this is kind of popped up from nowhere although I know I haven't, I haven't been filming for a while and I do really and truly apologize for that I've just found it so hard to get out this last few weeks it was a hard Christmas my son's birthday would have been in January and just everything was getting to me still is in a way but I just have to get back on with filming again but here we go we're gonna have a little quick look at our field and future football pitches through there and then we're gonna turn down and we're gonna look at I see Caroline's over there waving at me I'm gonna go and say hi Let's just nip across this road now. Ooh. Hi. <laughs> so I'm here with Caroline Gilfoyle. Yes, Caroline James Vlogs. Oh, sorry. Yeah, and, Caroline James. And I'm here with Leica 31. Yes. So if you're watching on my channel, take a look at her channel. And if you're watching on my channel, take a look at Leica 31. Because yeah. we do occasionally all cross paths, but often we're filming our own things so we're here to look at the steelworks yeah i just spotted this going well i spotted it a few days ago but i haven't been out for a few days and i've not filmed this for a few yeah. days but i just was like whoa where's that come from i thought you'd take the opportunity today well that's it right <laughs> well seeing that caroline's going to be filming here i'm going to give you guys a quick look at this and then i'm going to head on to seaside as well film bonnie street yeah yeah, I might see you down there later. Oh, you might. <laughs> might not. Either way, nice uh, to see uh, you. I'll be down there tomorrow or something anyway, but I'm sure we'll sort it. Yep, good nice. to see you as yeah, well. Good to I'll see you catch well. you later, mate. I'll catch you later. All right, see you later. So, walking back. See you later, guys. Bye. So there we go. There is our steelworks going up. It's going up really fast, actually. But if you want to see more of this, just watch Caroline James Vlogs, watch her video. And I am going to head on down here and we're going to take a look at Bonnie Street, Chapel Street, Central Drive, Blackpool Central Development because that is going up really fast. Although this video is nearly four minutes long already so this might end up being two videos because I think we can have a look at the Festival Leisure Park Bingo 3000 development if you take a look at that Oh, there is work going on on the back look the outer shell of this building looks pretty much completed now I'm pleased to see it being done I'm not actually a bingo fan but I think a bingo will be really popular in this area and you know it, it'll just be good it's good to see a, the space not going to waste excuse me I almost burped then so 
for a while when it looked like it wasn't going to be finished I was like oh no we just don't want a rusting shell of steelworks you know just decaying to nothing so when they started to do it finish it off it was really cool you can see piles of bricks there you can see there's work going on there so yeah so what I think we'll do is today we'll finish this video off just heading on down here having a little walk about and a chat around here That, that could have something built there there could be a nice little house built there this is the old central club closed down you can see the crane there that's working on the central development it's a big old crane there's a couple actually that's coming up really fast so we are going to take a walk down there and that will be in another video that follows this but for now we're going to just head on up here yeah, it was nice to see Caroline out and about we do occasionally all cross paths but not often anyway we're going up Princess Street now yeah what I was saying before though it has been tough to get out and film I've just had zero energy to be honest I mean with everything going on it's just been too hard and also it doesn't help the fact that it's so flipping cold I mean I know that is the same for everybody it's freezing cold and we're probably all too scared to put the heating on but thankfully we are getting towards the end of January now then we've really just got February to go which is a short month and then hopefully hopefully it will start to get warmer please let it get warmer I don't handle the cold well I know plenty of people that don't really mind the cold and they don't feel the cold but I'm one of those people who really really feels the cold and I feel it all the way to my bones I don't have a lot of meat on my bones or a lot of insulation so I get cold really easily I've got like one of those gigantic whatever you call them furry fuzzy hoodies my daughter bought it me for a gift just before Christmas and that helps I keep that on throughout the day and I've also got a pair of fleecy drama bottoms what I got from Primark and they're really thick they're super warm they're also super ginormous so when I put the drama bottoms on and the gigantic hoodie on it makes me look enormous it's really funny a solitary plane going under the bridge now on Princess Street this bridge a few years ago did get a whole refurbishment it was mostly rebuilt I think either way I do have a video of it I think I know I videoed it either when it was being done or when it had just been done I can't really recall which but I remember the old days when it was one of those big irony riveted bridge you know the ones that had the gigantic pieces of iron in and they were oh there we go reconstructed 2016 Yeah, I remember those gigantic bolts going through. Same kind of bridge was on uh, um, St Anne's Road, Watson Road, Watson Road Bridge. I almost said Waterloo Road then, but it's the old Watson Road Bridge. But anyway, we're going to walk towards the promenade and then I'll finish this video I'll nip down the prom and we'll catch up with Blackpool Central Development 
and if I've still got any energy left we'll try and get down Coronation Street few little streets there. I have been asked by one or two people if I'm going to start doing the Streets of Blackpool series again because I've had a couple of street requests and the answer is yes I will but again it just depends on when I have the energy and I know I sound like a broken record and I'm really really sorry about that but people I've talked to and you guys in the channel as well in the comments everybody's advised me to like don't force myself to do stuff if I don't feel ready, you know, just take it easy. But at the end of the day, YouTube is my job. It's not my main job, and it's definitely not my main money earner, but it's a secondary job, because my channel's actually legally re registered as a small business. But I have to register all the earnings and pay tax on it even though it's not that much so yeah YouTube is a job for me so I do have to really get up up off my butt and start doing videos again and I think getting out and about will help me hopefully I think I have to kind of give myself a metaphorical kick in the pants and just kind of push myself a little bit out of my comfort zone and get going and then hopefully I'll start to feel more comfortable again and better about walking out and filming. But anywho, I'm going to finish this video now. Just about to go on to Tilsley Road. You've got a little update shot of the old Foxhall village, Rigby Road, Tilsley Road development. So I'm going to leave you guys here with this view and if you're still with me, still watching this video, please just hit the like button and I will see you all soon in the next one. Goodbye.